I rigged that radio so you can contact our young lady friend, Poss. Is she okay? No need to worry. She's tougher than you think. Still just a kid. Which is exactly why she could be an effective source of information. Besides, that little Angel de la Paz is the one who gave us this mission, right? Uh, I guess. I'll put her on. Snake! Paz, where are you? Ciudad Colon. A school. The teacher told me to stay here until things quiet down. Teacher? Oh, him. He's... Yeah, that's probably good advice. See, he has a radio in his room, so we can talk anytime. <sighs> Pretty fancy for a teacher. Promise me, Snake, that you'll bring back peace and... I know. I'll contact you if I find your friend. Thank you. Snake, if you need to know about Costa Rica, the geography, the climate, the wildlife, anything, just ask me. I know about its history and laws, too. We learned it all in school. Got it. I have a question. I'll ask. I, uh... What? In school. I also learned that peace is an unnatural state for human society. And that war is a constant threat to our relationships with others. That's right. So, to achieve peace, we have to create it ourselves. Crying about it won't bring it about or make it last. Each one of us must go and seek it out. You won't find it without making sacrifices. No offense, but I don't know what peace is. Never felt what it's like. Huh. Never even been interested in it. Snake? Oh, sorry. Listen, Paz, I think your ideas are... admirable. And I hope they turn out to be right. Yeah, me too. Peace is in your name. Who better to help bring it back? Thanks, Snake. I will be here whenever you need me. See you later. Snake, use your radio to call people. But stay alert. You're in the middle of a mission and can't afford to let your guard down. Got it. Need to know more about Costa Rica? Paz can help you out. Good to know. We'll follow their transport route. This should take us straight to their main base. From what I've seen, it looks like nukes. Agreed. The key thing now is to confirm whether those spears really are what we think they are, and if so, why they're here. Follow the transport route. Find the nukes. That's what I'm thinking. First, we should make contact with the Sandinista Comandante. They can tell us more about what's up ahead. But it looks like their hideouts already come under attack. We better hope they're still alive. Snake, infiltrate that cabin and secure the Sandinista's Commandante. Neutralize any guards by knocking them out, putting them to sleep, or even using the Fulton recovery system. You choose how to handle it, boss. SLN Boathouse. It's northwest of there. You can use the radio you just picked up by pressing the start button to open the menu window. You know you can assign the radio to the select button by choosing options from the menu window.
for the FSLN hideout, Snake. The yellow butterflies around there are Juno silver spots. They apparently eat poisonous leaves and store the poison in their bodies. The boathouse should be close by. Neutralize the security detail and make contact with the Commandante. FSLN Commandante. He's inside the boathouse. dead. They killed Nuestro Viejo. You're his daughter. Then that makes you his delegado, right? Relax. I'm not your enemy. Cuban. Mm hmm. A cigar? I'll take whatever you've got. I owe you one. But I prefer cigarettes, you know. How do I look? A little like El Che, no? You Cubano? Mm, Colombiano. A photographer. I came to Costa Rica to take pictures of birds. Birds? Yeah, uh, Quetzals. 
You've got no telephoto lens. How do you get your shots? Telephoto's for amateurs. It's only the timing. Oh. Let me smoke okay. too. We can talk until I finish this. Chico! <sighs> Tell me what's going on here. This place is crawling with soldiers. They don't look like private security. More like hired guns. They're loaded with the latest gear from all over the world. I heard they're a security force hired by Codessa. <laughs> yeah, and I'm Papa Noel. Those guys are UCLA's. UCLA's? La Cia. I saw them, setting up shop in town. They're planning to do here what they did in Chile. If that's the case, what are they after? Whatever it is, it's not us. You don't think they're here to push you back into Nicaragua? Impossible. Too much hardware. Too many bases. Didn't you see? They've got helicopters, tanks. It's like we're in Da Nang. There must be something else. They have a base near here. There's a factory to the north, across a suspension bridge. Factory to the north, across a bridge. Have you seen the big transport boat, mercenary crew, on the Rio del Jade? You mean the barge? It's upstream from here. Up toward Yarasu. Hmm. Any idea what's on it? I could introduce you to some of our compas up there. But I don't recommend going to the mountains. We've lost a lot of people there. They take us captive, torture us for information about our compass, and then they kill us like pigs. Got it! All right! This was our last hideout, the final refuge for El Frente, after being pushed out of Nicaragua and into this peaceful paradise of Costa Rica. Then, El Monstruo attacked. A monster? Y mi viejo. Mi viejo, papá, tú es la esperanza, our hope. Now that papá's gone, my sister's la comandante de la revolución. Do not listen to him. Papá was a hero who fought by Sandino's side. I am only his daughter. You need a special talent to become cacique. It takes someone great to unite all of Las Compas. Sorry to interrupt, but leaders don't choose themselves, neither do heroes. You carry on his legacy of La Esperanza, and they'll follow you, no question. You think so? My compas trust me, but not one of them calls me Comandante. Amanda! <laughs> See what I mean? El Jolibri! They're tortured! Stay here. As long as I'm still alive, I might as well retreat. Over here! Find 
chico! ¡Venceremos! It looked unmanned. Unmanned? I'd heard rumors, but an operational unit? What the hell is going on here? Not to quote Amanda, but the hardware they've got here isn't just unusual. It's overkill, which means one thing. It's nukes. So the question now becomes, why? We can't make that call yet. We need more intel. How? Our source is dead. But his daughter isn't. Good thinking. We can follow her. Head for the next outpost, and make contact with Amanda, if she's still alive. Roger. 